uh, hi everyone welcome to this session so today we will solve this interview question so this is a uh, diode and capacitor based circuit and we have to draw the output voltage waveform and we have given this input voltage waveform this okay and uh, given that the capacitor cap both the cap capacitors are initially uncharged and both are having same capacitance value and here this uh, diode is ideal okay now let's solve it so we can we know that the diode like this is the ideal diode, right so it will the diode will conduct whenever the this let's say this p side and this is let's say n side so whenever the vp minus vn is greater than zero then the diode will conduct okay so if the diode conducts what will be the picture like reduced picture this will be nothing but this right so if this is the condition so there there is not present any resistor right so what will be the nature of this charging for the both of the capacitors this will be like instant charging right or immediate charging immediate charging right so we can see that uh, because there is a infinite current flowing through here right infinite current let's say infinite i so the here the charging will be like instantly okay so what we can uh, like what we can say is the capacitor is charging uh, uh, like without it taking any time like it will charge to taking like time t equals zero okay so it will charge instantly like taking no time to charge like charge okay so now we can see that the voltage here is zero voltage right and the voltage waveform is a ramp like it it, it, it is ranking up to on voltage right so now we can see that up to up to that point up to that point the diode is conducting right because this is on voltage and both the capacitor having same values so the v output will be nothing but v in by 2 right we can like we can use capacitive divider rule so what is happening here is this voltage is charging to 0.5 voltage and this voltage is also charged to 0.5 voltage okay so up to up to up to this condition okay so we can like so this will be 0 0.5 right v out let's say this is our one this is our two and this is our three voltage okay for this out so the the, the output voltage is reached to 0 0.5 voltage right so this will be like this will be 0 0.5 okay this is 0 0.5 now after that the input is falling from 0 to uh, 1 to 0 so here the potential is two voltage right we get like uh, one voltage right because this is 0 0.5 and this is 0 0.5 so let's say this vn is two voltage uh, uh, one voltage right so this v is uh, like vn is two voltage by uh, one voltage and here it is coming down from one to zero so this is less than one so here the p side of this diode having higher potential so the diode will not conduct so in this time period in this time period diode is off okay so if the diode is, diode is off what will be the picture this will be like this right so this will be the picture so this is c this is c and this is our v in so so the this is this is a open circuit so no can no current can goes through this capacitor and like cannot charge anymore and cannot discharge as well because there is no uh, shorted part to the ground so what what will be the behavior of the capacitances so it will help it will hold its previous value so the voltage v out will be 0 0.5 as well up to this let's say this is this is t okay and this is let's say mm, let's say t1 and this is let t, uh, t2 okay so up to this t 
it will hold its value okay so this will be the waveform now now after that after after that after t the voltage is the input voltage is increasing in 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 a ramping fashion okay so now we know that the voltage at this vn is still on voltage right because this is 0 0.5 and this is 0 0.5 so this is on voltage so uh, like uh, after when this v in when the v in voltage is greater than on greater than on then this diode will conduct right because the n side is already fixed at on voltage so v in needs to be greater than n to conduct the diode okay so now we have to see when the like at hot time the v in goes to greater than one on voltage okay so let's see so we can see that this is on voltage right so this will be like this so this so up to that up to that let's say this is tx tx time the diode is off so so this will be like this okay now after that when the input is greater than on like in this in in this region the diode is conducting okay so what will be the output like this will be like instant charging right and we can see that all the voltages like input voltages will be divided equally across two capacitors right so we can see that the voltage is here is maximum is two voltage right so all the voltages will drop across this C and this C. So this will be nothing but on voltage. Let's say on voltage plus minus, and this will be nothing but on voltage plus minus. So up up to like from here, it will reach to on voltage, right? The V out will reach to on voltage. So what will be the let's say this is this is our so here the input is two voltage. So this will reach to the V out will reach to on voltage in like in this fashion. Okay. Now the now we can see that the Vn Vn value reach to two voltage, right? Because this is this is now charged to one volt. Like this is this is charged to one volt, and this also is charged to one volt. So this Vn is now on uh, uh, two volts, right? Now whenever the Vn is greater than two volts then the diode will conduct again right until the diode is off so there is again like will will be this picture as well so there is no charging path and discharging path so the, the capacitor will hold its previous values okay so now we have to see when the like at hot time the input reaches to 2 volt so, let, so let's say so we can see that this is 2 volts right so up to that time up to that time the diode is not conducting so it will help it previous voltage so this will be like this okay now we can see that up to that region the uh, input is input is uh, greater than 2 volt so diode will conduct again right diode will call, conduct again so the charging will be like this as well but here how much it will go like this is this is 3 volt right maximum so both capacitor having same capacitance so it will divide it equally right so this will be 1.5 volts and this will be 1.5 volts okay so this will be our final like this will be our last output right so it will reach to 1.5 volt like this okay so this is our 1.5 volts and this will hold its voltage like this okay so this is the final output and I, I and i believe this is a very good, good interview question okay so this will be the waveform okay so you can think the, uh, uh, in this way or you can use the like the uh, like output voltage will be like the initial voltage and the voltage for for, for uh, like for this waveform like in in other way as well okay so i think this is the simple way to to go, go to go, go for the solutions okay so thank you everyone if you uh, like if you like our video you can subscribe our channel and uh, give your valuable feedbacks okay thank you